Welcome back to Anything German Shepherd. In today's video, we're going to talk about the 15 most popular German Shepherd mixes. The German Shepherd Labrador Retriever mix will weigh 70 to 95 pounds, be 22 to 27 inches tall, will have a medium short double coat, and less drive and aggression than a German Shepherd. It will be good with children and friendly with other dogs, and will be loyal and affectionate. A German Shepherd Golden Retriever mix will weigh 60 to 85 pounds and be 21 to 26 inches tall. Its coat will be a honey brown to light tan and will have a thick undercoat. It will be affectionate, loyal and trainable and it will also be good with other dogs, children and visitors and won't be aggressive if well socialized. A German Shepherd Siberian Husky mix will weigh 50 to 85 pounds, reach 21 to 25 inches in height It'll have a short to medium length double coat that'll be black tan, black white, or red white. They may have guarding potential and can be aggressive with other dogs and small animals. German Shepherd Rottweiler mixes will weigh 75 to 115 pounds and will be 22 to 27 inches tall on average. They'll have thick medium short coats that'll be black tan or mahogany with brown markings. These dogs will be loyal, protective and territorial, and potentially dog aggressive. A German Shepherd Pug mix will weigh 45 to 55 pounds and reach heights of 11 to 15 inches tall. They'll be silver fawn, black tan, or brindle in color, and will be friendly with children, other dogs, and guests, but will need constant human companionship. A German Shepherd Rough or Scotch Collie mix will have medium long thick fur and will be black, blue, black tan, black white, red brown, or brindle. They'll also be calm, loyal, trainable, and effective watchdogs. A German Shepherd Poodle mix will weigh 50 to 80 pounds and will be 15 to 26 inches tall on average. They'll have a moderately dense, wavy, medium sparse undercoat and will be black, red, black, silver, sable, or solid black. They'll be friendly to children and other dogs and are intelligent and obedient. A German Shepherd Chihuahua mix will weigh between 12 and 60 pounds and will be 10 to 20 inches tall. They'll have a thin undercoat and will be black and tan, sable, or solid tan. They can be snappy with children and strangers and can be challenging to train, but have good guarding potential and are loyal. A German Shepherd Corgi mix will have a short, dense double coat and will be black, tan, gold, white, or tri-colored. They'll be friendly with kids and other dogs and will have a strong guarding instinct and predatory drive against small creatures. They also tend to be intelligent and slightly stubborn. A German Shepherd Akita mix will weigh 60 to 85 pounds and reach heights of 22 to 27 inches tall. They'll be black, tan, fawn, blue, brindle, black, or pinto, and are intelligent natural guard dogs that are good for military and police work. A German Shepherd Wolf mix will make a good companion, will be difficult to train, intelligent, very predatory, and are heavily regulated or even banned in multiple locations. A German Shepherd Beagle mix will weigh 20 to 50 pounds and reach heights of 15 to 24 inches. They'll have short coats that are white, black, black, tan, or silver. And these dogs tend to be friendly to strangers, kids, and other dogs, but have high prey drives. German Shepherd Doberman mixes weigh up to over 100 pounds and are 22 to 26 inches tall. They have short coats that are solid black or black tan. They have high guarding potential and are athletic, intelligent, and obedient, but may be aggressive towards other dogs and small animals. A German Shepherd Chow Chow mix weighs 50 to 90 pounds and reaches heights of 22 to 26 inches tall. They're tan, red, white, or cream with black facial masks and have shaggy double coats and are protective, loyal, intelligent, and sometimes stubborn. And finally, a German Shepherd American Pitbull Terrier mix will weigh 50 to 80 pounds and will be 18 to 25 inches tall. They'll have short fur that's brown, tan blue, black and tan, or black with white markings. Training and socialization will be vital to address aggression, and they can be dog and animal aggressive. Thanks for watching. Feel free to subscribe and hit the like button. Until next time.